Sister Irene Ed Ferrer, MIC, School President, Sister Lily Manzana, MIC, Finance Administrator, MIC Sisters, Miss Shirley Tan, Grade School Principal, Supervisors, Grade Level Coordinators, Teachers, Staff, Parents, Fellow Graduates, Good morning. Today is truly an important day for all of us. This officially marks the end of our grade school journey. There were trials and setbacks we have faced, which are all the tip of the iceberg of our ride here in Ica. Today, we close this eventful chapter of our lives. In the next months, we will turn to another page. We will write new exciting stories and experiences. While turning pages seems exciting, let us revisit the wonderful memories we have all shared here. Many of us remember the days we only used to admire those Achis in grade 6. We happily said, I can't wait to become an Achi. We were excited just thinking about what it was like to be in the grade 6 classrooms and pose as role models to the lower grades. Finally, we are the Achis. While our expectations in grade 6 were a little different from our realities, it proves how far we have come. Because of that, we should be proud of ourselves. Three years ago, the pandemic changed our lives. It was a terrifying time. The rise of death tolls, the sudden spike in cases, and the abrupt transition to online classes. Majority of us did not even know Zoom existed. During our first few ODL classes, many of us were frantic on how to log in and keep track of our schedules and confused on how to use Edmodo and Google Classroom. I remember how some of us mixed up our schedules and ended up joining too late in the Zoom meeting room, ended up joining too early, or were absent because we had no stable internet connection. The transition from online to on-site was not a piece of cake either. We had to write on paper, and on top of that, in script. Reviewing for on-time quizzes was more challenging. We had to do everything in school and still be responsible for checking the LMS. Still, we managed to persevere and got used to the changes. Now, we can access our works online and operate our own devices. We can edit videos and play with different apps. Although we struggled because of the pandemic, we cannot deny that we develop new skills and learn more about ourselves. Our stories will not be complete without the important characters, our friends. We made many, we made many memories with them. We played tag, hopscotch, red rover, Pepsi 7-up, hide and go seek, and Chinese garter. We talked about arts, music, idols, movies, and our dreams. There's a nostalgic feeling of entering the grade school library and borrowing Stilton books to our heart's content. Do you remember rehearsing for field demos? How about class competitions? Did your class win the cleanest classroom award? What was your chance during the relay games? Going back to school made us eat with our friends, as if those years online did not separate us. Take a look at us now. We connected. Growing with our friends and batchmates has been such an amazing part of our lives. Let us continue to cherish these wonderful memories. I am sure each of us face personal or school-related problems. Some might be easy to overcome while others took a toll on us. Many times, we wanted to give up and stop trying. There were moments where we felt alone and could not bring ourselves to continue. Yet, that didn't stop us. We were able to get back on our feet with personal encouragement, love and support from parents and teachers, and, of course, God's continued guidance. Through prayers, patience, and perseverance, we are here today proudly holding our diplomas, a proof that all the sacrifices surely pay off. It has been a sweet to think that not so long ago, we wore our first grade school uniform. We would get annoyed because our moms were forcing us to take pictures to show that we made it to Iga. 
Don't forget the four smiles and the Instagram hashtag off to big school. Now we are wearing our high school uniform. And might I just add, all of you look great in it. Time sure flies fast. This is a reminder to treasure each moment with classmates, teachers, friends, and family. Do not rush. We still have a long way to go. Let us celebrate all that has happened and everything else that is to come. Cheers to us, Batch 2023. Let us continue to move forward and write together the pages of our beautiful youth. Thank you so much and God bless us all.